What do you want me to do? Stop on the fuck it. All right. What are you doing? Um. Well, it looks kind of like I'm driving a forklift, planning something crazy. <laughs> Gonna have to go around there. There's no shoulder. Oh. Boss, I'll do it now. Yes, yes, boss. Oops, sorry, dude. Uh, I need to uh, program this into the old uh, sat nav over here. Just pop it on the side of the road there. We are going to. Uh, where is it? There is a. There it is. The boathouse. Off to the boathouse. Uh, at no, no, actually, I need to take a right here. We need some gas. So, uh, yeah, the plan, pretty much, take this forklift to the boathouse and see how long before the cops mess with us. Because I'm guessing it's going to be pretty soon. Driving a forklift up the highway. No cop, no stop. <laughs> I'm totally getting fired from a job. <laughs> oh, God, I don't think my boss will want me anymore. But hey, man, he told me to get this there no matter what. Well, that was a sieve then, it's a fucking AI in a panto. Gotta love these forklifts. <laughs> and I'm not certain forklifts run off gas. I'm not 100% sure though. To be honest, I've never driven one. My brother got a forklift license, but I don't. I know the ones at my work are electric, but then they're indoor forklifts, so I don't know if that's different. They look different to this, so they probably are. I will lick your asshole till it's shiny. There it is, fucking AI. <laughs> oh, why? They say some random fucking shit. The best are the ones on the phone, like the AI on the phone, because they say some stupid stuff. Ooh, we don't have tail lights. That might be an issue. I'm putting my forks up so they don't scrape on the ground and we can go faster. <laughs> that's my lo that's GTA right there. Just if you lower the fork left, it starts hitting the ground and slows us down. So if I lift them there, well, if no, actually they'd be in my way like that. No, nope, that's even more in my way. That'll do. I'm looking through the grate. Yeah, that's fine. I can see where I'm going. Hey, it looked like someone found their charger then in the text chat. I'm on the overpass, I think I see it near it, near Augury Insurance. Hopefully I can get a cop to respond. Hey, that's not bad. Well done, dude. You found the uh, Challenger. I'm holding traffic up like a motherfucker. But hey, my boss said get it there, so I'm getting it there. Just barely limped my new project home. Luckily no cops, so... We're leaving the city now. How far do you reckon we'll get? Leave leave your answer in the comments. How far do you think we'll get? Don't no cheating. Don't go to the end and see. Do you think we'll make it? Do you think we'll get close? I reckon panorama. That's my guess. At like the airport or something. That's before we get fucked up. I, I doubt I'm gonna actually uh, stick around for the cops unless they can make me a deal. I can hear a siren. Or I could for a split second then. Just going up the 13. This is where Route 1 turns into Route 13. Passing the way station. Well, that's always going to be the way station to me. I know it's not a way station anymore, but it's always going to be known as the way station. Of course, if we do make it there, we're going to have to mess with the cops. Just drive around the area, see how far we can go. Oh, it's only in the 911 call center. That's probably the uh, Challenger guy. The guy that found the Challenger. Uruguay or Augury or whatever insurance company. I know where that is. That's not far from the FIB building in the city. Which makes me think that I'm about to see four cop cars flying down the 13 now. <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me. 
They're probably like, oh, we got nothing to do. Meanwhile, I'm driving a fucking forklift up the highway. Is that a cop? That could well have been. I couldn't quite tell. No, you're not sneaking past. Holding up as much traffic as I can, doing 40 miles per hour. <laughs> 45, 46. God, this is a fast forklift. Steer's like dog shit, but it's fast. I think I have a driving license, but I'm not sure. Didn't really think to check that, if I'm honest. I'm hoping we get stopped by Matthew, because Troy and Matthew are still, well, Troy's just certified to be LEO, Matthew's on probation. So I'm kind of hoping Matthew stops us, because he'll be the most fun to fuck with. Of course, this is a forklift, we can just squeeze around the side, like... Ooh, that was close. Oh, you dick. I didn't touch him, officer. I promise. <laughs> We're overtaking in a forklift. Let that just sink in for a moment. Just casually flying up the outside in a forklift. I think we might actually make it. What the fuck? That's a dog barking. We actually made it. That is, that's impressive. There's a decent number of cops on, but somehow we made it. Right, so, uh... <laughs> I guess let these guys do the work. I'll wait and come and collect the forklift afterwards. Thanks, guys. I think I might go to the Yellow Jack. Or Liquor Race, actually. It's just around the corner. Get drunk. Right, so they finish with a forklift here. I need to go and... Uh, I don't know why I'm using this little walkway, driveway thing. I need to refill my forklift with gas and go down back down to the city. So, uh, yet another long drive in my forklift. Oh, why am I turning right? I don't even know... What the hell? You know when your brain just does something? And you're like, why did I do that? That just happened. I don't know why I turned right then. I was thinking, right, go left. And I just turned right. <laughs> Gotta love that logic. Oh. That is an AI cop. I'm pretty sure they should be disabled. But, you know. Right, back on the road we go. What the hell? The fuck's your problem, dude? That's a nice challenger. God, I love challengers. I would 100% buy a charger. Cha charger? Challenger. Ooh, ooh, I'm intrigued. What's going on in... Oh, frick. What is going on in the Lello Jack? That's a nice ass skyline. Matte orange, I like that. That's a good choice. What's this challenger doing? Well, I blew that stop sign. <laughs> do do do. I can't see you. <laughs> Drift in the shit. All right. What do you want me to do? Stop on the fuck it. All right. Ah, my neck. Pull over to the... Hey, I didn't even hit you, man. Get off onto the side of the road. Off the on-ramp. Oh, blew in your bloody siren at me. God damn. It's Troy. <laughs> Up a little bit more. <laughs> What are you doing? Um. Well, it looks kind of like I'm driving a forklift. 
Does it really need this massive response? Um, dude, you're not supposed to have this on the roadway. Why are you having this on the roadway? Because my boss told me to. And I ain't saying no to my boss. Have you seen him? God damn, he's like six foot six. He'd kill me one, with one finger. If you want to tell him no, well, go ahead. Matter. Well, your boss, well, your boss is an idiot, honestly. I don't know why he has you on this road. Because I was working back there at Sandy, and I'm driving back to the depot in the city. Well, get a flatbed, dude. Come on. You can't drive this on the highway. And I can't tell my boss what to do. If my boss says no flatbed, go drive it. I'm driving it. Trust me, that dude's terrifying. <laughs> you have your license and registration, man? Um, yeah, sure, here you go. My name's Mc Charles Stevenson. Charles Stevenson? Alright, also do me a favor, shut this thing off. Yeah, I guess I can do that for you. Vehicle options, engine off. That's a uh, nice hat you got there, Trooper. Thank you. And uh, that's some nerdy glasses you got there as well. Going on today, bud. Yeah, how's it going, officer? Going all right, Lieutenant Strachan with the uh, Franklin County Sheriff's Office. McCharles Stephenson. Switch out, riding in this thing. Nah, my boss told me to drive it, man. Boss tells you to drive off a cliff. Would you do that? Yeah, my boss is terrifying. I ain't saying no to that motherfucker. Alright, All right, well, I'll tell you what, we could be uh, just as terrifying, so... Yeah, exactly. Yeah, but you can't fire me, so... I can get you fired real easy. Is that a threat, What's officer? Um, <laughs> well, this is going to be... Do you have your weapons on you? Uh, I got my 50 cal. Well, next, well, next, I'll let that slide next time. In the state of Ohio, when you're in a traffic stop, you gotta let an officer or a deputy know that you have that weapon on you. Yeah, I forgot. It's under my seat. I forgot I had it. Alright, don't go reaching for it, alright, man? Just keep your hands on the wheel. I am. Uh, what would you say your name was there? Mc Charles Stevenson. Oh, press on button. Mick Charles, or just Charles? Yeah, Mick Charles. <laughs> All right. That's his first name, Mick Charles. All right, Mick Charles, go ahead and uh, go ahead and step off of the um, the uh, vehicle here. Uh, is there any reason? There is a reason. You can't be driving this on the main road, nevertheless, uh, the state highway. Yeah, I know the routine. Have for safety reasons. I'll stick to the yeah. shoulder and all that, it's fine. Um, but there, there's no shoulder at this point. You, you get off the forklift. Then I'll stay off road. It's an off road vehicle, Doesn't kind matter, of. Dude. Well, where, where uh, are at you this headed? Point. Down to a uh, construction site down in the city. Construction site down the city. Why didn't you guys bother to have a tow truck or a flatbed of some sort come pick this shit up? No, man. I asked my boss and he said, no, they're too expensive. I said, that's not legal. He said, you're driving it. And I said, yes, sir, don't hurt me. And that's pretty much where we are today. <laughs> okay. What's your what? boss's company's name? Um, it's the um, Los Santos Forklift and Construction Company. It's abbreviated to LSFAC. C. <laughs> I made that up. <laughs> okay. Why, why are you working for such a dickhead boss? Because. I mean. Someone's gotta give me money. I mean, if you wanna give me like 20 grand now, I'll retire and leave the forklift here. That's always an option. Jesus Christ. I thought my boy was grand? a dickhead. That, that's... that's easy. God, that's like nothing, boys. Peanuts. Yeah, well, I... We're in a high-vis, I work in the public sector. So, what do you want? Deputy, why don't you shut the fuck up and get out of the front of the forklift before he runs your ass over? Do I have permission to? No, no. we don't have permission to, sir. 
I mean, it's pretty tempting. It only takes a second or two to turn a key. Alright, listen, here's what I want you to do personally. I mean, this, this officer stopped you, said at the end of the day, it's his call, but here's my recommendation, I think. You turn this thing around on the dirt and you haul ass back onto Route 68 back there, take the shoulder all the way up to Sonora Road and take Sonora Road all the way down to the city on the shoulder. Yeah, that sounds like a plan. I can do that, I'll that's a good I'll compromise. You, your, uh, company. you what? I'll sorry, Mike, sorry to talk over you, but um, I can follow you back, make sure nobody hits you or anything. I mean, if you want to, but that's up to you. That's your prerogative. Yeah, I can, I can do that for you, man. That way, nobody hits ya. Awesome, I'll turn I'll this you thing what, around. Man, you, tell you, you tell your boss if there's an accident caused that involves this vehicle or is the cause of this vehicle, your boss is looking at some pretty serious fines and he's going to get in some serious trouble. So you go ahead and you send that message to him. Uh, if not, we will do so. Yeah, okay. I, I'll warn you in advance, he's pretty terrifying. <laughs> okay, I've been to Iraq and Afghanistan. Nothing's terrifying to me. Oh, ISIS is nothing compared to this motherfucker. He could break me in half with his nails, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Sounds like, uh... Sounds Hello. like a rough job you got there, buddy. Yep. So, uh, am I free to turn this thing around then, or...? I think you guys can see what's coming. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm good to go, man. Uh, it's, it's your call. Yeah, we can cut you loose. Right now, we'll, um, we'll let this slide just once, but... You can also tell your boss they uh, rent cheap trailers down in the city, like for, what, maybe like 20 bucks a day maybe? One of those cheap little flatbeds? I will whimper into his office and give him the message. I may die in the process, but I'll and do it. Like, like my boss here said, oh my god, AI is just in mind. But like my boss said, if we catch you on this thing, and the accident on the road again, then we're gonna have some issues, alright? Yeah, that's fine, I'll flip it around on the dirt now. Across the dirt. Sounds like a plan. So, if you guys got nothing else, well, I'll follow you back then. Awesome, have a great day, guys. Right about. Every time I'm oddly specific on their wording, it usually means I'm d planning something crazy. <laughs> he said across the dirt. That was dirt. Is he actually just going to let that slide? Wow. <laughs> Am I actually going to get followed all the way down? Hey, look at that motorcycle cop. This thing's pretty jacked up for a forklift. <laughs> I can't believe they're just casually okay with that. Me shooting across the highway like that. That's fucking great. I look like I'm drunk. <laughs> He's got his lights. Take it to the shoulder, bud, like we agreed on. Sorry. <laughs> This rear wheel steering, man, it's got me. It's quite tricky, this. I'm doing my best. Oops, I hit that. <laughs> Try to keep it away from the sides, alright? Yeah, I'll do my best, man. <clears throat> this rear wheel steering's a bitch. You can get on the road to go around these guys. <laughs> oh god, this is great. 24 miles an hour on the dirt. 
No, no, there's two signs. One says 45, one says 50, and they're practically right next to each other. And then the one down here says 45. I'm gonna have to go around there, there's no shoulder. Oh! Damn it. My boss is gonna kill me. <laughs> you alright, bud? Yeah, just hit my head on the rebar. It's fine, I've done it plenty of times. Alright, hang on. <laughs> that Riley car is just like, nope, not dealing with that shit. I think I might be getting demoted. Yeah, you think? Alright, um, listen, get a hold of your boss, I gotta deal with something, alright man? Yeah, I'll do that now. <laughs> Damn it, I think I'm angry at my car. God, I love those muscle reflexes. <laughs> uh, emote. Yeah, boss. Boss, you there? Look, don't kill me yet, but I flipped the forklift. Okay, guys, that is going to do it for today. I think we did a great job at pissing off Troy. And uh, almost getting permission to run Matthew over, so that's always a bonus. And I'll see you next time. Peace out, guys.